It's often said that making a phone call on a plane could cause a malfunction and even make it crash. But is that really true? Can a simple phone signal actually mess with an airplane's electronics? To find out, the team bought real aircraft instruments and brought in an aerospace expert to help them set up a working communication system. To check if the system could receive signals from an air traffic control tower, Grant climbed to a high point with an antenna and sent signals to a nearby airport. Sure enough, the instruments responded. But what exactly does a phone signal interfere with? The communication system or the flight instrument? themselves. Since you can't see electromagnetic waves, they used a spectrum analyzer to detect the signals. They also replaced the phone with a tunable signal generator so they could control the frequency and power more precisely. To block outside interference, they built a brass Faraday cage, basically a shielded box that isolates all signals from the outside world. Inside the cage, Grant began the test. The instrument in front of him showed the plane's position relative to the runway. If the needle started to move, that would mean interference, a potentially dangerous situation. At first, nothing happened. But when he tuned the generator to 800 megahertz, the same frequency range used by cell phones, the needle suddenly jumped. That meant phone signals could interfere with a plane's instruments, at least in theory. But what about real communication systems? Could they actually be disrupted? For the next test, they rented a small business jet equipped with the latest avionics. To avoid any accidents, the insurance company only allowed testing on the ground. Grant brought the equipment on board and started making phone calls, trying to disrupt the airplane's communications. But even after using several different phones, and even boosting the signal strength, everything worked perfectly. The plane's systems stayed completely unaffected, even with multiple phones calling at the same time. That's because all of the airplane's wiring is heavily shielded, designed to block out external signals entirely. So, why do airlines still tell you to turn off your phone? It's mostly just a safety precaution. After all, in aviation, even the smallest risk isn't worth taking because one mistake could mean disaster. 